Welcome back. Being the director of a newscast like this one can be a busy and stressful job. Sure can. That's why when one of our directors tried hypnosis to de-stress, it changed her life in more ways than one. WLTZ's Ricky Van has this special report. Cut it in five, four. Behind the scenes. Two. There's a lot to juggle directing Ready First up? News today. First news, right in the one camera, one. But the lady behind the controls, Nicole Jones, keeps the show up and running smoothly. What you don't see is the mess she feels in her mind. I had a, a high level of anxiety. Looking forward to relaxing on the weekend, she looked to alcohol as a way to unwind. I didn't overindulge, but still, I, I just felt guilty for even have to, having to turn to that. Along with some volunteers from WLTZ, she sat down to be hypnotized. Follow each and every instruction I give you. By professional uh, hypnotist uh, Richard Barker. Your hands uncrossed on your laps. He says he can help teach her moderation. Now, breathe in. Close your eyes. Breathe out. Just allow your heavy head to rest down to your chest. That's good. You know, we're in this rat race, and just to be able to take a deep breath, close your eyes, and visualize, and, and to be able to let the brain relax instead of it constantly running helps you refresh. He told the volunteers to think about sleep. As you relax in your chair, I want you to imagine something. I want you to focus in on the soft muscle tissue surrounding your eyes, known as your eyelids, and I want you to imagine your eyes are becoming heavier and heavier and heavier now barker spent time talking with each person to understand whilst you bite your nails it's a better alternative to smoking a cigarette however as you chomp your nails you'll realize in fact it is an anti-social habit telling nicole not to binge drink you'll know when to stop you'll have a natural ability and a desire to close your eyes and say to yourself no more and i've literally had enough nod your head if you understand Good, just relaxing. All fish food. Most of the volunteers were able to stay in a trance and follow Barker. Others were not, but he says that's perfectly normal. I think we had like 10 people initially, and uh, out of those 10, they're all in different groups. You've got, you know, somebody from self doubting that it actually happened to them, all the way through to somebody like D, you know, very somnambulistic, which is very a deep, good level of, of hypnosis. While several were deep in the trance, we had to get back to work. One, two, and three. Eyes open. Give yourself a round of applause. You guys were fantastic. Well done for relaxing, my friends. Did you actually but see that did it lessons? work? We caught up with Nicole about a month later. How do you feel? I feel great. I cannot even explain to you how awesome I feel. But wait, there's more. She stopped drinking altogether. Like when I go in a store and I see like alcohol, I get sick. Like I. I totally didn't see any of this coming. It's in the air that we breathe. It's not in a bottle or a pill. It's not a lotion or potion. It definitely has made me more calm, more confident. Music. Let's teach the subconscious mind how to deal with it and how to, how to move on. And into the weekend with a clear mind. In Columbus, Ricky Van, WLTZ First News. If you'd like to work with a professional hypnotist, you can contact Richard Barker directly for a recommendation right here in this area. Yeah, his contact information is on our website, WLTZ.com. You can watch this story again there if you'd like as well. Oh, well, I can attest. Nikki and I tried to go to dinner last week, and she had wanted nothing to do with <laughs> the, nothing to do with the wine. Huh. So, so instead of just temporary, maybe that's permanent for the yeah. rest of her life. It'd be interesting oh. to see. Hmm. Altering people's brains. <laughs>